Hey, it's Tony Dynamic Listings. Today we're at Jerry's Camping Center in Madison, Wisconsin. Hey, we've got the 2021 Sunray Sport by Sunset. This is a micro travel trailer, yet it has all the amenities you would find in a larger travel trailer. Designed to sleep too, weighing in at under 1,300 pounds. A perfect travel trailer to pull behind a four-cylinder SUV or small pickup. So let's go dive in and take a look at the Sport and see what makes it such a great vehicle. So the Sunray Sport is quote unquote the off-road version. So you do get the larger 15 inch wheels and tires, they're kind of an off-road tire, steel wheel flares. This one does have a six inch lift on it, so it gives you that extra clearance down the side and we do have a leaf spring suspension so it rides nice and smooth. Love the red and black graphics on here. There's your exterior air conditioning, two speakers outside right there in the red stripe. And then we do have two outside outlets, 12 volt outlets, and a retractable one step uh, to get in and out, of course. Up top, you'll notice there's an accessory rack. You can see your air conditioning and your ventilation. So you can put your kayaks or canoes up on top if you'd like. As we swing around the back of the Sun Race Sport 109, we do have LED tail lights. The tailgate is lockable, two locks there, and then when we open it up here, you're gonna see the galley. Love the Sport, Sunray Sport graphics across the back, and here's your kitchenette. So, wood, uh, light wood on the kitchenette. Everything's wood except for the refrigerator door, that's an applique, but it looks really great. It's a retro style, you'll see on the inside how they tied that together. Up above, two storage components. Apartments. There's a 12 volt outlet, that's what your microwave is plugged into. So plenty of storage over above. LED puck lights, there's two of them overhead. Here's our two burner LP range. We've got a single basin sink, but I love the high arching faucet here. It makes it super easy to wash your pots and pans and clean up afterwards. Storage underneath the sink. Two 12 volt outlets here, so you can plug in your toaster or, or your margarita maker. Love the refrigerator, it's small, but it's a refrigerator and has a small freezer area. So you're gonna be able to bring along your frozen and your fresh and you're good for the weekend. Above the refrigerator is where we find our microwave. Super clean, super easy to operate, does have a digital clock. Great place to warm up your sweet corn or your leftovers. As I mentioned earlier, the refrigerator door is not wooden, so this is a vinyl applique but they tied it together nicely with the real wood and gives it a nice classic design. Your overhead is less than six feet, so you gotta be short to climb under here, but it'll keep you out of the, out of the elements. And the door is pretty light, easy to close with one hand. So let's go ahead and swing around to the utility Let's make side a run the down the driver's so side. You're find your so here's our, our circuit breakers outlets, and such for our furnace. Are all on this side. Our water so connections, fresh water connections. We've got, We've got our, our satellite or cable TV our, uh, hookup. Got a satellite TV bar. or cable TV There's hookup. We do have an exterior shower. There's your uh, shower port to plug in the land. That's a nice storage underneath here. A nice here. storage compartment underneath. And this that be too is so lockable. Out. Inside. Box on, on yeah, there. Gloss black on that the door. And then that is lockable with the same now that key. lift the tailgate. You can during the brake, I discovered that those uh, wheels and tires actually do an additional six inches of lift. That large window there, there is so that's your cool. emergency exit window. Let's start up, take a look up front. So there is room for one LP tank. Up front, there's room for and your batteries up front. And an and then you do have a full-size spare and tire, and that's the same tire. wheel and tire really that's on the ground. So if you do swap it out, you're not going to have that oddball wheel or tire, the same, same all-season road tire that we've got on the ground today. So our tongue, our tongue weight is like 120 pounds or so. The overall width is about eight and a half feet. We're looking at about 12 feet. So let's go ahead and dive overall in terms of the overall length. So it should be no problem to pull behind your small to medium SUV. One of the things that I really like about the Stop. 109 series is the door itself. So it's a two-piece door with privacy glass and very few of these small micro trailers actually have a screen door on them but they put one on the Sport and I think that's a nice added benefit especially in July when all the mosquitoes come out. So inside just a classic retro look with the light wood paneling similar, similar to the kitchen. We've got the red and white vinyl padding uh, for the bed, forced air for your heat 
system, so not an electric heating system. All the windows, these windows do have uh, shades that you can pull down, and they're all privacy glass. As I mentioned earlier, the larger one above the sofa, that's going to be your emergency exit there. And then those cushions can be removed. They can be put on the floor for a second bed or extend the one bed. This wall does have a TV backer board. You can plug in your entertainment system. Notice we have overhead speakers for the sound system. Here's your electric ventilation fan. We also have puck lighting up above. You've got your fire alarm, if you will. There's your air conditioner. Nice little storage compartment. Uh, over on the left-hand side, or the right-hand side, I'm sorry, we've got heating and air conditioning thermostats. There's your sound system controls and your master panel to shut off all your switches, all your lights when you get out. Uh, plenty of room in here for two people. If, you, if it turns into a crummy day, you won't mind staying inside and watching a good movie stretched out on the couch. Of course, you do get the fire extinguisher, and there's another 12-volt outlet on the inside. The other thing I like is the flooring on here. It's a vinyl flooring, but I like the faux wood, gray wood finish. And then way down here behind the silver pole, that's our carbon monoxide detector. So you'll be safe while in there. Hey, if you get value out of the video and you like it, go ahead and give it a thumbs up.